I was very fortunate to start out building plank on frame and then I shifted into a coal molded jig boat. And the reason I did that was because of the, the demand of, of our clientele. The clientele wanted me to switch to that, so that's what I do. Which boat is better? I get asked that a lot because I'm one of the few that can build both. I design both and can build both. And both are equally as strong and both are great boats. Um, I don't see any great advantage to either one. And, and I say that because half, over half of my boats are, are plank on frame and, and a lot now are jig. And they're both performing equally as well and the longevity of the boat seems to be equally as well. It's customer driven. Well, you know, the, the boat, boating industry is customer driven. The boats are getting bigger and bigger, and the horsepower is going, getting larger and larger. But at the end of the day, it's always driven by what the customer wants. So we will adapt and build whatever that man wants. I mean, if he wants something with uh, 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 10,000 horsepower outside, we are more than willing to do it. Nowadays, with the, uh, with the technology and the, the computer driven stuff, it's, it's a lot easier to do um, uh, than it used to be. Well, you know, Dare County people are very friendly, and it's kind of cool that, you know, that each generation, you know, that they're, they're willing to teach somebody like me the boat building, how to, to build a boat, you know, the, the layout of one, and the little tricks, and pretty humbling, you know, that they're willing to do that and pass it down to us. You know, me being a young builder, any time that I have a question, you know, John Bayless answers this thing, you know, any time I ever, like, he's, he's been very helpful to me, you know. Just you know, trying to figure stuff out, and he's he's very open. You know, he's been a been a good mentor as well. It's pretty neat that you have a community that's really revolves around boat building, commercial fishing, charter fishing. It's really a group that's called you know Boat Builders Foundation, but it is that group of people. It's a tight knit group of people, and now we're able to provide opportunity for families, kids in the community to better their education, maybe get into what we're doing, you know, boat building or, you know, fishing or whatever it may be, um, but provide that opportunity for them so that they can continue that down the road.